The Mississippi Immigrants' Rights Alliance is sending a clear message of support to immigrants from across the globe. Today, the organization met for a civic engagement day at the Mississippi State Capitol in Jackson. They discussed racism, hysteria, and attacks on immigrants across the country. Madeline Marcel says the public charge rule is a deliberate display of racism and discrimination. The rule was approved by the U.S. Supreme Court in January. Under the new policy, immigration officials can deny green cards to illegal immigrants over their use of public benefits. The public charge rule is a direct assault on tens of thousands of Mississippians. The new policy could cause up to 73,000 immigrants and their family members in Mississippi to stop using public public benefits such as Medicaid and SNAP or avoid enrolling them in the first place. Nearly all of those impacted are immigrants of color and many of the children are U.S. citizens. Going back home and then you don't see your parents and, or your someone you love and next you know you find out they got taken away for something that they weren't doing, they were just trying to provide, just trying to get money, uh, get money to their family. Father Jeremy Tolbin says this reminds him of his experiences during World War II. He says politicians should know that families are sacred. Seeing how they treated the Jews in Poland, they're, they're doing the same thing the way they're treating the immigrants here, but those massive raids are Gestapo, also known as ICE, takes these people and just splits up families like what about the sanctity of the family? Mira meets annually at the state capitol for Civic Engagement Day. Reporting in Jackson, Deidre Briscoe, 12 News.